a dressage rider and trainer from New Zealand. I'm currently over in Germany at my wonderful trainer Leonie Brumel stable for a six week stint to further my education. I was asked by Equine Trader to do a few video diaries and to give you all an insight to the wonderful dressage world over here. I will be taking you to a few competitions, showing you some young horses and hopefully some training clips. Today Leonie's partner Volker Dusha is going to give us a little talk about confirmation in a young dressage horse. Volker is very shy speaking English to the camera so he says he's very sorry for his vocabulary but I think it, was, it is fine and you will understand perfectly. Volker is from a third generation breeding family. He has bred horses that are now in New Zealand. Woodsby owned by Kylie Baker who is a very successful dressage horse. Also the state premier Mia Bakera who is only three and standing at my, my home and also helped find my wonderful stallion Dorincourt. I hope you enjoy the footage. A three years old mare called Serafina. She is bred by Scolari out of a Don Federico Wittinger dam line. You see here a very modern, typical horse with a wonderful shape in a rectangle type. When you have a look to his her face, very beautiful, very elegant with a big eye. Then you have a look to the neck. It's wonderful, constrated. It's coming out of the shoulder and it's getting more smaller up to the neck, to the top. That's what we are looking for. When you have a look to her whole type, she's standing on long legs, has a wonderful saddle point with a big wither and a wonderful constellated croup. By Zerafina you can see a very big shoulder with a wither which is going deep in the back line. That's what we needed for the saddle position and for the rider that he is sitting more to the hind leg and is getting of this point a better balance under saddle. When you have a look to the front leg, this front leg is very good constellated. It's coming out of the shoulder to the fetlock. This part should be very long and should be longer than the part from the elbow to the fetlock. When you have a look to her, please come around with the camera. When you have a look in front of the shoulder, it's a very big shoulder. And when you see here, you have space for a whole hand. That means that the horse himself have enough space for movements out of the shoulder. When you have a look on her foods, they are big enough and good enough. Never forget that the foot of a horse is like a wheel on a car. When you have a brighter wheel, it's becoming oh. a better driving on now the road. we look a little bit to the details of the hind leg. She has a very good concentrated croup with a good bone on this way. It's falling a little bit down. Yeah, it's a little bit more vertical, that means that a horse can use her hind leg more forward. Very good constrained leg with a good uh. ankle, very good constrained angle in the hock. With this hock, um, you have to think, when you have a look to the hind leg, you have a think about a little bit about a spring. Yeah, a spring means that from here is the energy and comes the power to get the movement.